of the great things about an awesome meal or a delicious glass of wine is it's not just food and drink, it's a journey. So now I'm going to introduce you to an amazing wine and a very special wine person who will guide us on such an amazing wine journey that you'll be booking a ticket before you know it. So I've caught up with Christina Mariani May, the Empress of the Banfi family empire, to talk about Rosa Regale. So this is such a jewel of a wine. It is one of the most special surprises when you have it in the glass, and it is by far my favorite. So this is a wine from the Aqui region, mm -hmm. right? It's a real specialty of that area with a grape that most people haven't heard of, right? It's a grape called Brachetto. 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 We have to say it with our Italian accent. Yes, we do. <laughs> Brachetto from Aqui. From Aqui, okay. And that is in the Piedmont region. Take us there in terms of what the wine country looks like. Oh, so beautiful. Rolling hills to all the like, ancient villages. The town of Aqui is actually an old spa town, and it's just very romantic. It can get cool at night, but um, beautiful sunshine, particularly for the Brachetto grape. So Banfi, that's the family mm -hmm. wine enterprise. Heart and soul in Italy and you've taken over the reins from your dad, who was an icon of the wine industry, right? I'm so lucky, Andrea, to be third generation in the family wine business, doing it with my first cousin, James, and I'm fortunate that we have the most beautiful estates in both Tuscany and Piedmont. So, it's a gorgeous bottle. Tell me about that. It's like faceted on the bottom. You've got this beautiful rose or rosa. What's the story? We wanted to make a bottle that was really unique and special. So my father, John Mariani, designed it after an antique decanter. So it's something that really is very much like the wine that's inside it. It's one of a kind. So the Banfi Rosa Regale, is, it's its own thing. It's sparkling, it's pink, it's delicious. It's love at first sip. Yeah, it really oh, is. I'll say it. That's right. Take me into the glass here and describe this. So when you smell on the nose, you're going to get beautiful almost rose petals. Really? Hence the name Rosa Regale, the right. regal rose. Absolutely. But also a, quite a bit of, think of, of, of framboise, a raspberry. Yes. A little strawberry. Wow, raspberries, rose petals, even a little bit of sweet almond paste in there. It's amazing. Once you get it on your tongue, there's a textural surprise there, a little bit of bubble. What do the Italians call that? Well, they actually call it frizzante um, or vivace because it's vivace meaning liveliness. It, mm -hmm. it tickles your tongue. Right. Almost dances on the palate. Absolutely. It's got a little bit of spritz, super crisp, lovely red fruits. What would you pair with this wine? Oh, one of my favorite things, chocolate. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> a little bit of chocolate. I'm there. Um, raspberries, strawberries, or for example, something salty like prosciutto right. and formaggio, the cheese. But chocolate and rosa regale is the match made in heaven. Well, so speaking of drinking this in heaven, on board you, we have a beautiful chocolate sundaes, we have a cheese course, and low alcohol and refreshing is great for when you're in flight, mm -hmm. so how about that? Have you ever tried this wine at 35,000 feet? I have, I was very fortunate, and there's nothing more relaxing than being on a Delta plane with three little kids at home, and I'm getting served beautiful wine. So you can drink this in flight, but there's another place in Italy at the historic heart of the Banfi estate that you, you have to take us there. I've been there, it is an unbelievable place. They serve the Rosa Regale there. Tell me about Castello Banfi. This is our castle that's among 7,100 acres in southern Tuscany. As far as the eye can see, it is some of the most beautiful vineyards, olive groves, and also a medieval fortress. I can just say firsthand, I've been to Il Borgo. It is unbelievable. My husband and I were there. We shared a romantic glass uh, of Rosa Regale. And uh, I believe your chef paired it with some beautiful gelati. It oh, was amazing. Magnificent. So we can go there. There's a, a restaurant. Um, can we just check in and stay for a while and pretend we're an, an Italian principessa? <laughs> Definitely. We all have to treat ourselves like principessa or principi when we go to Italy. Italy should be on everybody's bucket list. And hopefully at some point, Everybody can visit the romance and the gorgeous scenery of Tuscany. Well, Christina, thank you so much for sharing this amazing wine with us. It's truly one of a kind. We're so excited to have it for Delta, and we're all now really excited to come visit Castello Banfi. <laughs> oh, we welcome you. Benvenuto. <laughs>
So to get to Tuscany, you gotta go there. You can fly into Rome or Pisa, so it's really easy. And then you're just a hop, skip, and a jump from Castello Banfi and Romance. Yay. Uh.